Okay, our next speaker today is Alexandra Shiglova from St. Petersburg Electrotechnical University and St. Petersburg State University. And just short remark that Alexandra is a great grandchild of Olga Alexandrovna. Please. Oh, thank you. Uh, first of all, I want to thank the organized committee and uh, audience uh, of this conference for the opportunity to make a talk. And uh, it's a uh, this is a joint work with Alexander Lich Nazar. Uh, we will discuss uh, next problem. Uh, we consider the equation one with fractional Laplacian in the space R n R n. Uh, in a dimension more than one. And um, the exponent Q will be from two to uh, critical uh, embedding exponent for the Sobolev Slobodetsky space HS. Uh, the fractional Laplacian minus delta power S uh, is defined by Fourier transformations for any positive value of S. And uh, we want to find some new classes of solution for this equation uh, having different symmetries. In the local case, if we have the classical Laplace operator in this equation, uh, for the model equation, uh, for the model equation, uh, Lerman, Narishkin, and Nazarov in 2020 uh, suggested a vari variational approach uh, based on the concentration compactness principle of Leon's and uh, reflection. Method. We uh, consider this equation in some domain and uh, then in some uh, polyhedron. And then, after reflection with this polyhedron respect to some of the side, we extend the solution from domain to the all space. And, uh, and describe the method to construct the different solutions uh, with different uh, symmetry, with different symmetry. Uh, this method uh, also applicable to equations with P Laplacian, applicable to the equations with uh, more difficult uh, right hand and uh, we modified this method to extend and extend it to equation with uh, fractional Laplacian in the left hand. Uh, and model with um, model equation uh, was investigated by many authors too. And uh, we suggest different approach, but uh, only, uh, only with method suggested by Lerman, Arikin, and Nazarov, uh, we can to extend for fractional Laplace. Now we consider the domain in the space with piecewise smooth boundary and denote in with domain spectral fractional human Laplacian uh, as uh, as power of uh, Laplacian uh, in a spectral sense. More precisely, we consider the quadratic form uh, defined by 
values and IG functions of uh, Laplace operator with Newman boundary condition in omega and uh, define the spectral fractional Newman Laplacian as a self adjoint operator restored from with quadratic form. Uh, I know what the first eigen function is constant and uh, first eigenvalue is zero and uh, it doesn't include in this sum. Here the first eigenfunction is not constant. It is known what for S uh, from zero to one, the definition setting of this quadratic form coincides with uh, Sobolev Slobodetsky space HS. And uh, we consider the norm of this uh, space as the quadratic uh, form plus uh, L2 square norm. Then for domain omega, uh, we consider the sequences of expanding domains omega r, uh, driving by gamma theta of omega, and consider the extreme problem in this domain. We consider the ratio of uh, hs norm in square uh, hs norm. Uh, of other uh, by LQ, square LQ norm of function and uh, tends with functional to minimum. Due to compactness of the embedding, uh, because our exponent Q is subcritical, the minimum is attained and uh, earlier equation for this uh, functional uh, coincides with equation two, but in the right hand we have the Lagrange multiplier. Uh, because Q is more than two, we can re uh, normalize function U. So, what uh, Lagrange multiplier be equal one and uh, the equation two will, uh, the solution of the equation two, the minimizer of our functional will be solution of the equation two. Uh, the equation two uh, is very similar to the initial equation one, but uh, the equation one, I have no number, this is equation one, I am sorry. Uh, but the equation one is uh, equation in the all space. And uh, here we have the conventional fraction, fractional Laplacian. But the equation two is equation in the domain. And here we have the spectral Newman Laplacian. Uh, we know what uh, we know what the minimizer minimizing function for function LG is not negative because after replacing u to absolute value of u, the first term with quadratic form doesn't increasing. Uh, and uh, solution of equation two, uh, which, gener uh, which generalized by minimizer of functional G, we will call the least energy solution. Uh, we can prove what any non-negative solution of equation two is a uh, infinitely small function and positive in any strictly uh, internal subdomain of omega r. And the main uh, tool for proof 
with LEM uh, or next results is the Stinger Tare extension uh, of fractional Laplace. Now let omega be polyhedron in the space. And let u be an arbitrary solution of the equation to uh, not least energy. When we uh, can consider the double domain, uh, we can change, we can choose one side of this polyhedron and uh, reflect sorry, and reflect our domain uh, with respect with side gamma and uh, consider the extension of our solution u by even reflection with respect to gamma to the double domain omega tilde r. This function u tilde will be solution of the equation in the double domain omega tilde r. So we can do more than one reflection and uh, we can extend our uh, function to, to the domain consist of some, uh, some exemplar of initial domain omega and uh, this extension function will be solution in the uh, in the double, triple, or or more than two exemplars of omega domain. If so, if our polyhedron can fill we uh, can fill wall space, we can uh, extend the solution from domain to wall space by even reflection. For example, uh, in the plane inner two, uh, we have some figures uh, which uh, which satisfies uh, with property. For example, rectangle, uh, square, right triangle, right hexagonal, hexagon, but uh, we need the ad uh, additional con condition. We, uh, we consider the domains which filled the space with color check wise. For example, right triangle satisfies this condition, but right uh, hexagon don't satisfy this condition. And polyhedron which satisfies the color check wise condition, we call the fundamental domain. If our domain, if our initial domain is fundamental, then omega r is also fundamental. And uh, we can extend the least energy solution from this domain to the wall space. And uh, the main result uh, is the next. The function u defined on the wall space is a positive solution of the equation one. And uh, we want to, to find different solutions. But after extension, we 
can construct the same solutions. And uh, Nikita Ustinov in 2020 showed what if uh, initial domain uh, omega have a small diameter, then uh, the last energy solution will be constant function. And after extension, we will get the constant function in the wall space. It is not interesting case. But um, if the coefficient of gamma theta r is sufficiently large, then the least energy solution in the domain omega r is not constant function. Moreover, uh, we have the concentration theorem analog of uh, concentration compactness principle of Lyons. If we consider the sequences of minimizer of functional G uh, normalized in LQ, when we have the sequences of points uh, XR uh, such that for any small epsilon positive uh, exists the positive row uh, such that uh, all energy of function, uh, all LQ, almost all LQ norm of minimizing function UR concentrated in the ball of radius R centered in XR. With uh, sequences of points XR uh, named the concentration sequences uh, of solutions. You have three minutes more. Oh, thank you. And if we consider the rectangle, the concentration point uh, may be at the angle at the side of the rectangle, rectangle and in the inner of the rectangle. For sufficiently large R, uh, second and third case is impossible. And we have the concentration point in the corner of the rectangle. After reflection, we get the solution with concentration point uh, location on the uh, red point. All with uh, solution for sufficiently large air and for different uh, ratio of sides of uh, rectangle will be different because uh, our equation are not, uh, is not invari invariant respect to gamma theta. If we consider the right triangle, the concentration point will be in the angle two. And after reflection, we get the solution with uh, symmetry structure on the second figure. Also, we can consider the triangle with angles Pi of the six, pi of the three, and pi of the two. If we uh, construct the list in the solution, the concentration point will be in angle X. And uh, with uh, case is equivalent of uh, right triangle case, because after reflection by uh, segment ZX, we take the right triangle but if we uh, but if we get additional restriction for the minimizer function u uh, we can to construct the solutions with concentration points in the point y and extend with solution to the solution on the plane with hexagonal structure of concentration points. Also, we can uh, add two restriction 
and construct solution with concentration points in the another hexagonal structure. Moreover, we uh, can consider the spectral Dirichlet Laplace and construct the solution uh, and construct the sign changing solution. And I think I show the picture is uh, plus or minus uh, defined uh, the area of positive and negative value of function. Here we also have the concentration theorem, but the different solution will be for any values of uh, R. And uh, we can see the mixed boundary condition, uh, Newman for one pair of opposite side and Dirichlet for another pair of opposite side and so on. And uh, we consider the quasi-periodic complex valued solution. We consider the breather type solution. And with method, uh, your time is method, almost over. Oh, I'm sorry. That's all. Okay. Thank you very much for your talk. Questions? Yes. Uh, I have a question. Uh, oh, sorry. Uh, okay. Mm. Ask you, please ask your question. Uh -huh. uh, what happens uh, with your question when S goes to one? Uh, repeat, please. Uh, what happens with your question when S goes to one? S goes, S goes to, to one. one. Uh, S is a fixed parameter. It, it, not goes to something. In if S is equal to one, we have the same structures. But for classical Laplace operator, it uh, was known, and it, it was uh, described by Lerman, Narishkin, and Nazarov. Okay. One more question. Thank you, Sasha. I want to ask a question. Uh, so, in the bounded domain omega r, you work with the spectral fractional Laplacian, right? So, my question is basically: Can you um, do the same, not with a spectral fractional Laplacian, but with some other fractional Laplacian, and then extend to the fractional Laplacian in the whole space? Um we can consider the restricted fractional Laplacianal. Uh, yeah, for instance. For, for, for instance. Uh, no, this result is only for spectral fractional Laplacianal. But we uh, can consider spectral Laplacians with uh, another boundary conditions. Uh, I can add uh, uh, this method works only for uh, spectral Laplacians. Uh, the, uh, the boundary conditions can be uh, different, and uh, uh, it works uh, for many variants. But the spectral is uh, necessary because uh, the uh, property of doubling of solution it does not work for restricted. Yeah. Uh, that's the main point. Okay, more questions? If not the case, let's thank the speaker again. Okay, 